expect a steady quarter from Reliance Geo, the telecom business of Reliance Industries. Revenue growth is seen up 2% quarter on quarter and a little more than 10% on a year on year basis. The CNBC TV18 poll throws the revenue number at 25,900 crore for the March quarter. Margin improvement trajectory is likely to continue and this quarter we are working with an EBITDA number of 52.5% and expansion of 20 basis points on a quarter on quarter basis and the profit jump is seen up 1 to 1 1.5%. There are two internal metrics that we track very closely. One of them is the ARPU, the average revenue per user which is basically the monthly tariff. Uh, and that is seen steady. Remember, we've not seen any tariff hikes from the industry in more than two years now. So the ARPUs have been steady for the industry, 181.7 in rupees. Uh, and the second metric is the subscriber addition. And this quarter, we expect uh, Reliance Geo to add between 10 to 11 million subscribers. Now, TREI gives you the monthly subscriber ads. In the month of Jan, they added about 4 million subscribers. They added about 3.5 million subscribers. You add them up and you get to about 7.5, 8 million subscribers in two months. So which is why the three-month estimate is seen closer to 11 million. But what's the street going to watch? Well, Vodafone Idea is doing that large FPO. So is there any tariff hike which is on the anvil? Because the street is expecting that post-elections we could see a tariff hike and also there's a chatter about geo ipo so in the agm is a company going to talk about that or perhaps even in the press uh, you know in uh, the q4 uh, conference call i think there is going to be a lot of uh, scrutiny on that